On today's stream, I watched even more of the creepiest ghost sighting videos I could find on YouTube. There's a channel on YouTube called Bizarrebub that puts together creepy compilations of any ghost sighting videos they find on the internet. And some of these are absolutely terrifying and completely inexplicable. Others, on the other hand, are completely explicable and very clearly fake, but often really funny, so... Either way, it's a good watch. All that being said, if you do enjoy this, either for the scares or for the laughs, please feel free to subscribe. I do plenty of horror content over on my Twitch, and all of it gets uploaded here. So if for whatever reason you can't tune into the live streams, be sure to sub to this channel so you never miss the uploaded streams here. Anyways, all that being said, I hope you enjoy this stream. Let's watch Scary Compilation version 72. Let's go, people. I'm in couples woken up late at night. Wait, no, I need subtitles. I'm good. I'm not good at listening. Uh, English Auto General. Oh, that's all they got. Okay. A German couple is awoken at night. This already sounds terrifying. The German people are an extremely efficient people. Ruining their eight hours, that's already fucking terrible enough. All right, this is, this might already be the most scary thing we see in this compilation, but let's move forwards. A German couple is woken up late Thanks at night crime, after hearing strange Ooh. noises coming from the attic. Ah! Ah! I heard a strange noise! Ah! And began to record. Sorry. So they heard a- to say. The video they caught has left them more than just baffled. <laughs> this is my favorite part about this channel. Whenever he says camera or video, he always pulls up a picture of a camera or like an iPhone or something. <laughs> As if to like remind you what um what cameras are, like what videos are taken on. Every single fucking time is like, oh, a video. Yeah, no, shit, my bad. Like, <laughs> it really makes me laugh. <laughs> but also terrified. Now, the couple in this video are German folk who had bought a house in the U.S. <laughs> Why does he keep stressing that German? <laughs> Although the exact location of where they live isn't known, it seems. Well, no, I would hope not. What are you, you going to do? Dox them? Yippee. Been hyped for stream all day and oh, loving thank all you, man. the horror stuff it. lately. Yeah, what does he mean? Their exact location isn't known. What? <laughs> it's like. <laughs> what were you gonna do to say it on stream? Their exact location is 308 Negra Aurora Lane, Albuquerque, New Mexico. Uh, and you should go there to check for ghosts yourself. The German couple, in fact, do still live there. You can say hi. You know, like, what was he expecting? He's gonna, like, say their zip code? That their home situates on haunted ground. Oh, wait, what? Live isn't known. It seems evident that their home situates on haunted ground. Hmm. For a while, Evident, the indeed. couple has been experiencing strange activity. Whoa! Stop footage of moving lamp! According to them, takes place inside their attic, which expands okay. directly above their bedroom. It's, it's past midnight when the sound of movement is heard above. They hurry to grab their camera with the intent of capturing and showing others what's Ooh, been happening at their place. It? Ah! In it? This. Stop! People need to stop saying boo in donations because I will shit. I will shit. Shit will. <laughs> Shit will leave me quickly. I work in the meat packaging plant, but I can't stop that Jack Manifold grind. Uh, oh, those God, don't hand. seem to contradict each other. You can machine. work with me Someone and also help. watch me. Stop saying boo in the chat. I'm going to have to turn the chat off. I can't handle it. I need to do this. I'm watching like this. Shana Shana Mina. Because. She didn't say because, I don't think. Meet the ghost. Thank you for the prom. A ghost! Ah! Why are all the donations scary today? Wait, we need we, uh, pause. I know we're taking. A, I know we're only a minute into this video, sixteen minutes into the stream. The stream, but guys, guys, a ghost is just guys, guys, guys. I need to calm down. This is getting too intense for me, and I I will shit. Perhaps even vomit. My stomach doesn't handle negative emotion well. If I feel sad, my urge to vomit Four just goes through the roof. To the bald man. Let's go. Thank you. I appreciate that. I am the bald man. Thank you for your four-month sub. That I feel better now because I got money. Let's move on. Oh. Boo. That was a question, so I'm gonna say no, and we're okay. Oh, we'll turn the lights on at least, fella, walking around in the dark. No fucking wonder it's creepy. Switch a light on. Oh, you are. There you are. Cool. All right, good lad. At least you've got logic. Schnoofy. Schnoofy? The dog's called Schnoofy? 14 months. 
Hope you are doing well and to the ghost in Jack's house. Please definitely don't possess him during this stream. No, don't worry. It was in Eleanor Neal's house. I forgot to stress that. Uh, it w I, I, Whatever ghost I attracted, it wasn't here. Hello, Mr. Bald Man. <laughs> I'm safe. Three. True crime YouTuber Eleanor Neal now needs to deal with that. And that's on her. You know, that that is her problem now. And that's okay. You know, that's okay for me. Schnoofy's a very cute name, though. That's his Lord. Thank you. Who said thank you? Schnoofy. Snoofy. 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 Oh, Snoofy's cute. I like that dog, Snoofy. Huh. What? Why do you do a huh? It appears that Snoofy is scared of something. <laughs> Snoofy hides under the. <laughs> Sorry, for some fucking reason the subtitle saying Snoopy just fucking killed me. It, it's not even that funny. Um but fucking <laughs> For some reason <laughs> For some reason <laughs> it being called Snoopy is just fucking kill me. I'm just like imagining this fucker. <laughs> it's like, like he's doing this with a ghost. It's not even funny. Like it isn't a joke. There's like no fucking humor. <laughs> oh shit. It's dumb. Sorry, I'm dumb. I'm really, I I'm real dumb. I just find shit funny. Bad for a couple of minutes before eventually coming out. Though, it isn't long after that she decides to go back underneath. What happens next is just downright creepy. Okay. Watch. I will. That's what I'm here for. <sighs> okay, there's a little bit of an artifact on the camera, but... Oh, Noise from the attic. I like how he didn't jump. He's just like... Strange. Peculiar. Preposterous, even. This is an analytical mind. This is a man without fear. Simply curiosity. The curiosity killed the cat, people. This guy's about to get haunted as fuck. That is so downright creepy, though. Oh, fucking hell! The fucking stairs to heaven! Why was it so loud? That's God up there. That's what you're hearing. ladder on earth <laughs> listen to those ladder noises like when it came down it was loud and bad enough the fucking listen bro goes in the creepy attic with the creepiest <laughs> shit's like comically creepy Alright, seems pretty normal. Attic normal. Oh. There's a little bit of movement over there. Was was there or was it just camera? Oh shadow. This is shadow. I wonder what that was. Alright. It's fine. There's like keeps being an artifact on the camera, but I, I don't think that's necessarily anything. Yeah, no, really? Normal?
This is... <laughs> is the is the clip that he found nothing? The music keeps picking up and I'm like... I'm a bit on edge, but nothing's happening. Fate comes. Yeah, it is strange, I guess, but like... Nee, nix. Überhaupt nix. Okay. Alright, back up the creepy fucking stairs we go, I guess. So has anything moved or What what I'm curious about is what is this big metal tube? Because like, say that's like an air duct. Like a strong gust of wind could cause that shit to bang around, right? You know? And then no wonder the, the Snoopy is scared, because like, say like Snoopy, like fucking, so it is an air duct. Yeah, it's like, well, surely like a big gust of wind could, you know, like, I don't know. I don't think it would be that loud. Yeah, if he's got like a, if he's got a loose vent though, like say part of it's loose. I don't know. And then Snoopy, like, he's probably just like scared because it's a loud noise. How do you think the AC is pushing in the air? No, but I mean, like, it's air from outside. Say your AC's broken for whatever reason and a strong gust is somehow, like, getting directly in. Like, I don't know. I just, I just feel like a broken ventilation tube could potentially do that. Like, if someone looks at their vent tubes and goes, like, no, then, you know, I mean, I'm not the fucking AC guy, but I'm just saying. It just, just looks quite loose. It feels like a, like... A, like a big gust of air could cause it to move. What's he doing? Leaving the camera up here? That's smart. Oh no, okay. What are you crawling around for, little bro? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Bro fucking hit his head. <laughs> but he hit his fucking head. <laughs> the, 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 the thing falling's creepy, but him hitting, hitting his head is funny. That's funny. But I don't know, I mean... Let's see, he hits his head. It is a bit weird, because like, I wonder whether it was like the, 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 the sort of him hit, the impact of him hitting his head that makes it fall. And like, kinda? Because he hits his head, and it starts falling, and then it like jumps. But, like, it, it definitely seems as if, like, it jumps a bit, but say it's like, on something, and it begins to fall, and then that thing falls like underneath it, like say it's like a weird balancing act. I don't know, I, it's weird, but like the fact that the motion begins with him hitting his head makes me think that there is reasons for that to have happened other than ghosts. But bro said it jumps, yeah, but watch, it kind of does. Like it does like a little hop, you know? Like, let me just get that back, like it does a little hop. It falls and then, but like, that could have, nah. I don't know. It's like it falls and then gets hit. Yeah, but what if it falls and by slipping a bit, dislodges something underneath it, that then falls, hitting it. Like, it... it I just feel like there could have been a chain reaction there that is explainable. Albeit a bit odd, but I don't think this is like, ghosts are real, this is quintessential proof. I just, I don't know. If more shit happens after this, I'll... Oh, bro, just sealed the camera in there. 
Snoopy was shouting. Thanks for the prime, man. Three months, yippee. That was loud. Hey, you have three months. That was really loud. I must admit, it is weird. Kelsey, thank you for the prime. Five Ooh. months. That's what? weird, too. Manifold dub. Assuming they've left the attic, that's weird. Oh, and the camera's moving a little bit. That's also weird. All right. All right. I'm willing to accept According that ending's the couple, weird. They were too scared to go back for the camera. It was only after a day or so that the husband had gone back up and grabbed the camcorder as quickly as he could. The camera was low on battery when he retrieved months. it. Hope you've Yo, been well, thank you, man. That's manifold. a fucking long time. Appreciate it. But after being given a full charge, they looked over at the camera's roll and saw the video that was taken that night. Is that the smallest thing to the their farm? shock? Wig the bald camera Mr. caught footage. Bald. Of what they believe is a poltergeist. From a high metal vase, initially seen perfectly balanced on top of a box, being jolted upwards at a slight angle, to another object being chucked across the same space, the couple oh, is that. absolutely certain that their house is haunted. I didn't see the well, other thing. It's impressive. I, like I am, like you know, I'm. Not impressive, but like it's it, it's weird. It's weird. The lights thing's weird. A dog's behavior might be a good indicator that something strange was truly happening. And loud noises. Dogs get judge scared. As to whether think... or not that's so, did the couple actually capture video evidence of paranormal activity, or had something else occurred? Unless they're trolling, like that's the thing. Like when he goes downstairs off camera, it's like, oh, does he really go downstairs, or does he just ch close the lid and turn the lights on and off a bit? Like, does he just close the thing to make the noise and they go? You know, like say they had one friend in there helping them. That was so easy to like fake, like could have easily trolled, but you know. Feel free to let me know what you think. If it's a part of guys, it's gonna have fingerprints, ghost writing, and fingerprints. <laughs> Wait, fingerprints, ghost writing, and what? Sorry, uh, something else. That's funny. Pa Phasmophobia reference. Phasmophobia. Um. No. Oh, I forgot to send this guy. I was supposed to send this guy my clip to put in his compilation. I completely forgot. Wait, I should do that. I completely forgot. I'm going to do it right now. I completely forgot. That was one of my tasks. I'm going to do it right now. I'm going to email him right now. Um, let me compose. Compose an email. Is there a way of making that big? Because I don't want to show you all my emails, but I also... Want to write it? Ah, oh, here we go. Okay. Let's do this. Two, scary videos, 444 at gmail.com. Live stream ghost capture. Hold on, I need to go gra actually grab the clip. Hey, uh, okay, I'm gonna put, hey man, no word of a lie, this happened on my stream whilst reacting to one of your vids. Video was paused and nothing else was playing. There is no reason I could, I should have. heard that sound can we see the clip i'll show you guys the clip again i showed the clip at the start of the stream but i'll, I'll show you again i know what about this happened on, uh, on my stream while i was reacting to one of you this video was paused and nothing else was playing there's no reason i should have heard that sound um the apartment is super well sound proofed and high up meaning you can't hear external noise and I've never once heard the neighbor neighbors uh dead 
Definitely super weird. Thanks, Jack. All right, I'm gonna send that shit. Oh, I need to attach the clip. Check out. I joined clip. you saying I will shit. After one year, I expect nothing less. Sometimes a man has to poo, man. I mean, that's normal. That's like normal. That's normal. Let me just show you the clip. So welcome, Raiders. 18 uh, months, woo. Manifold, let me show y'all. Let me show y'all the clip. For those people who haven't seen it yet. This is the clip we're emailing over to the guy. This happened to me live on stream. It's a real thing that actually happened while watching Louder one of this guy's videos. when I farted in a silent class. That's pretty loud. It's always, that shit's always loud. Oh, I got punched in the side today. Shit still hurts. One of those fucking I suppose lower body shots. I ain't never take one of those before. That, that shit hurt. Hurted. Link the VOD. You would be more on edge when you hear noises. You know what Ooh. I mean? Right, the, the, the more demo. on edge when you hear noises. You know what I mean? I suppose you would be- It was weird. It's weird. It's a weird thing that really happened while I was live. And it was while watching this guy's videos. I just think it's, you know, it's, it's let's say topical at best, you know? You look so blue in that. Yeah, it's because of the lighting. Different lighting. It's because there's orange behind me. and I'm, I'm being lit by a, a screen just like I am in this clip, this clip but, you know. Why is it not copy pasting the link? It's not pasting the link. Or oh, I think it is, but like I can't see it for some reason. Okay, the link is there, but like I can't see it on screen and, and I closed my email. Okay, well, pray there's a draft or something. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm gonna have to redo the email. Was it going to drafts? I'll think, fuck, it goes into drafts. Okay, the, the, the hyperlink's been weird. Um, uh, original VOD or whatnot. Specify at least one recipient. God! They make everything so hard in this, this crazy life. Cool. Cool. All right. Send. I sent it. I've sent the email. I just spent that whole fucking... Okay, there is a link. Why is it? It's being weird. Whatever. That took way too long to send an email. Tubbo was calling me. Tubbo was FaceTiming me. Hello, Tubbo on FaceTime audio. I'm live. I'm live too. Um, do you want to play Among Us VR? I, I wouldn't be able to set that up in, in, uh, while live. Why? I would have to move my computer into another room. Oh. I, I apologize. If you had warned me in advance, I would have done. Of course. Yeah, yeah, I'd love to do that. All right. Thanks, Jack. No worries, man. Speak to you soon. All right, I guess we're doing a Among Us live, uh, Among Us VR stream this week. This is how easy my job is. That's a meeting. We just had a meeting. Gonna write that shit off on business. No, I literally, I, I have to, this room isn't big enough. and I'd have to move uh, all my shit into the other room again like I did for the boxing stream. 
it's way too it, it's like it takes me like an hour to set up vr stuff which is fine but like i just i just can't do it today but we'll do it another day we'll we'll, we'll literally get it done like asap either way let's carry on watching scary videos i feel like we really got distracted omg there. five month but i am still keeping up with the manifold grind yes thank you welcome to anyone who came from turbo stream by the way i realized the view count went up uh we're watching scary videos if you'd like to join us feel free uh grim bun thank you for the prime uh, inside an elementary reason. school that's oh, been abandoned for decades from vast empty hallways to vacant classrooms. i love abandoned buildings i so want to film something in a fucking abandoned building like soon that shit is so cool i'm normal you are indeed normal snail that is it your name rooms the school is entirely void of anyone else inside it is or so it seems although the person <laughs> and everything is, is not what it seems when you you can get what you want by the simplest of means be careful not to mess with the balance of things because everything is not what it seems yeah i remember my i remember my shit i remember my shit it took me a minute but i remembered it or they claim that there's now a different atmosphere inside unlike before this place now gives a terrifying sensation chris hill who you may recall from previous oh videos, yeah i remember this guy he definitely fakes his shit Mm, well, no, I, I don't want to say that, but the most, like, insane paranormal clip I've ever seen from this guy uh, w was from this guy. And I just, I have my suspicions. I shouldn't, I don't want to, I don't want to shit on this guy. Maybe he doesn't fake it. Just, bro, he was drag, he was, he was apparently pushed across a room by a ghost. Like, he sat there and he flies back, but I swear someone yanked him on a zipline. This is the one who like like fl got flung backwards ten feet and was like knocked out. Like I don't know, it, shit was too good. Like that's like his most popular video ever is him going to this location. Right, he goes back to the location and he, like and and all of a sudden the most crazy shit happens. It's like mm, feels like you wanted to one up yourself for a sequel. I don't know. I'm just saying. <laughs> Strong ass ghost bro is built like a linebacker. True. Fucking throwing that guy 10 feet is a, is a feat in itself. But yeah, I don't know. Shaq couldn't push him. Yeah, exactly. I'm just... This is what I mean. I just... I have my skepticism about Urban this guy, but we'll see. encountered many strange things. But it seems that the following video may just be the this strangest a, of them all. He picks really cool looking locations. I'll give him that. He's like a... He's a really good location scout. Late at night. When Chris oh, he has one. a rundown elementary school all on his own. As he walks carefully through the barren hallways of the place, he immediately starts to feel uneasy. Sort of bright teared wallpaper looks sick. It's such a mistake. Thanks for three pounds, Tyler. Ooh. That's creepy. Sort of splattered paint. That's kind of that's creepy looking. Paramede, thank you for the tier one. Rip who? Ooh. Rip Paul Revere. In 23 to 2015. I don't know who Paul Revere is, but I know the name. The classic items right that now, are though. left behind make the place all the more creepy. Is it the further exploration of other classrooms adds more to the creepiness of the site, as more school materials are seen left behind. Oh yeah, it has yeah. been trash. As Chris continues to scout the place, it becomes a. This place has been trash. Thanks for the fun time, Mr. Manifold. No worries, of course. Appreciate your tier one. But yeah, no, the, the, I remember like this happened to our secondary school once. Uh, but, like, on a smaller scale, like, some older kids broke in. Like, kids who used to go to the school, they broke in and, like, trashed the place. And I remember, like, the, one of the teachers telling us about it, like, nearly crying. Uh, but it wasn't this bad. This is, like, really bad. But, yeah, this this feels too good. Like, it's like a movie set. It just looks really cool. Parent, that something far more chilling resides at the school. As Chris walks further into the building, this is captured. He's going back, back to the lobby. Me when I get killed in Fortnite. Me when I kill children in Fortnite. Sending them back to the lobby in Fortnite. School just prepares children for Fortnite. Safe That's why they've got a big lobby. Safe is still here. Of course, bro. Who's stealing that shit? That shit's heavy as hell. 
Bro, I know. You could steal that and you're big. You're a big dude. You're a strong dude. That's all the subs, by the way. I really do appreciate it. What? Oh, that was a, that was a scream noise. Also, like... Ooh. That's what I mean, though. That shit's... Uh, right, so in my ghost video, I did a couple of fake bits. I, I, I made it clear in the video that, like, the point was that we, like... We had some faked sections to try and scare the guys. Like, we went ghost hunting, but I faked some shit to try and scare the guys I went with. And one of the things we faked was a figure walking past a window exactly like that. Like, I I'll try and pull up the clip. Um, you. Like, the in here, in this room. Speak to it too loud. What's that noise? What noise? Did you not hear, like, a... Noise. Oh, look, wait, 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 there's a motion detector. <laughs> if there's any ghosts... Time for my monthly speaking privileges. Hello, Jack Y Boy. I have managed to get an interview for a production management internship at Ooh, Disney. Ooh, that's really cool. Well done. Also, better now, they give the tier one. Anyway, let, let's... This is what I did. Motion detector. Oh, yeah, don't make it... Don't move. Wait. Wait, 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 there's a motion detector. <laughs> if there's any ghosts, we're gonna see them because of the motion detector. Oh, yeah, don't make it, don't move. Wait, did you see that person move? There was a person, you can see the shadow in the background. And like, like that's like, we faked that exactly because we were like, that will scare the guys. It's a very effective, easy thing to fake because like, tinted, shaded windows, like, He's just done the same shit, bro. Like I did this. I know. I know. I know. It's easy to fake because I've done it, bro. It's so obvious. I think I did it better than this, pers personally. Can I be honest? I personally think I did it better. I'm sorry, but like. Timing is too perfect. Exactly. Like, I'll admit, I'll admit, right? Like, it's well done. It is well done. Like, because you see a figure walk and then somehow it, you don't see it. That is quite well done. I don't know how you pull that off, but at the same time, it's, it's, it's too good. It's too good. I assume editing, maybe, or, you know, I don't know. Like, was the shadow not clipping over the edge of the wall? I swear it was. Oh, let's watch again. It was standing right here. I think that was the shadow of the arrow. Let's watch, th let's watch the original. Oh, hmm. Mm, maybe. Let's, let's let's watch the frames. Uh, maybe there's a little bit of bleed there, but like, I don't know. It's not too bad. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's fake. That's pretty bad. That's what I mean about this guy. They're cool videos. They're entertaining videos. Like, don't get me wrong. He picks really cool locations. Uh, you know, he reacts really well. And like, and, and the th shit he sees, he makes convincingly quite creepy looking stuff. But, bro, like, it's definitely fake. Where the f did he come? Where the f That's what I think. Yeah, no, I'm not convinced. It's creepy, but if it's real, but nah, I don't know. It was standing right here. He's probably in this room. Get my gun. You getting your what? You getting your gun? Bro, who are you trying to shoot? A ghost? 
I don't think bullets is gonna work, my guy. Did he say I'm getting my gun? Bro, you're not the police! Hello. You're <laughs> No, he did not hit them with the hello. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, kick the door open and hit him with a stun. Hello. Bro is not the FBI. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Average American greeting. <laughs> Like the average American entering a home. <laughs> Just pulls out gun, kicks down door. Hello? Fucking hell. Jesus Christ. Shit's hilarious. I'm sorry. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. I've never heard someone say hello like that. Like, like I can't, I can't quite like figure out what the tone is. Like, like how, I, what is, like he's like, hello. I want to hear that again. Oh no, wait, I'm it. Let's get back far enough. Hello. 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 <laughs> it's just weird, man. Oh, that's so funny. Fuck. Americans will try and solve anything with a gun. Literal otherworldly beings with no physical form. And American be like, I'ma shoot it. I'ma shoot that shit. Like, bro saw it disappear into thin air and he's like, I can definitely shoot it though. Fucking crazy. Hello? <laughs> oh god, that shit's funny. That's really got me. That, that's the best ghost clip I've seen. Like, I've seen scarier ones, but that's that's my favorite for the fucking raw entertainment value. Hello? <laughs> oh, that was too good. Oh, come off it! He does this. Uh, like, he did this in the last one where he's like, this room is significantly colder than the other rooms. Look at you, how you can see my breath. That was vape. I'm sorry. That shit looked like vape. He hit the jewel. Like, last time I believed it, this time that was vape, bro. That shit's vape. That's an elf bar. I'm sorry. Like, no. That, that smoke's way too thick. No one's breath has ever been that visible. In the Arctic, maybe. But, it, like, no. <laughs> bro, I had to take a hit of the jewel. He was scared, you know? <laughs> I don't mean to shit on this guy so much because I really don't actually hate the videos, but come on. What? Where are you going? What the fuck is this little room? It's getting really cold. What is going on? Like, it's not doing it every breath. This is the thing that's like, it's doing it some breaths. Like, that's what's getting me. Without warning, a very faint scream is heard somewhere in the building. Immediately afterwards, Chris turns around and sees a moving figure across the room. That's way too convenient. You hear a scream, you spin, and you look the other direction. You're like, ah, oh, fuck that. He no. runs over to check inside but strangely, finds no one there. He then checks the closet space, but also finds nobody inside. It's Hello? As though the person he saw vanished into thin air. They did. Further they did. adding to the strangeness is the drop in Fry, temperature when Chris the, uh... leaves the room. Blue. Now this is very similar to when Chris had explored an abandoned warehouse, which turned out to be extremely haunted. Perhaps the same thing could be said about this place. But when considering the following occurrence, this notion Thanks becomes to the, uh, more like the gym. case. Early on, Chris had explored a different section of the building when suddenly this happened. Oh, there's more? Of course there is. Can't always catch streams, but just wanted to That's say okay. hi. That's okay. I appreciate you being here this time. Hi. 
Thank you for the tier one. This is a real ass back. human bag. Love the horror streams. What's your favorite shape of pasta? Uh, <laughs> very unrelated points, but thank you. Uh, like linguini. Um, <laughs> it's like cool. Didn't you just prove that like all the strange shit that's going on is likely the other living, breathing human being in the building that you've just caught on camera. You didn't catch a ghost. You caught a man. It literally, they caught the fucking intruder from the Mandela catalog. Shit's a creepypasta now. Let me get my gun. Hello? Hello? Hit him with a hello. Hit him with a hello. Hit him with a hello. Oh, man. Fuck sake. <laughs> um, uh, oh. Fuck this. No, I'm I'm sorry. This Hello. No! He didn't! He did not! He did not! No! <laughs> I can't believe it! <laughs> no! No, he didn't! Bro! What is, who does he think? Why would you like if I had a gun, right? Like I, I don't have a gun. I'm British, right? But I'm pretty sure the procedure is to be like, I'm just warning you, I'm armed. Like you, you generally warn the person you're armed. You don't hit him with a stern hello. <laughs> hello. What are you? What are you doing, brother? I fuck off. I. I Let me get my gun out. Hello? Oh my god. So he tells people he's armed, yeah. If, if you ever hear, you, if you're walking down the street, you hear, hello? Fear for your life, because apparently that's code for I have a gun. Gee. <laughs> you learn more about America every day. A simple greeting could be a threat. My god. Oh, he's still there. What? Oh, it's a toy. Oh, fuck off! Fuck off! Oh my god, that scared the me. It was stood upright, bro. Fuck off. Holy. It scared the hell out of me. Excuse my language. Excuse my Christ. language. Hello? What is it? Fuck off, bro. Hello! You, you tell me that conveniently really creepy thing is left in this abandoned elementary school? Like, shout out your prop designer. It's cool, but... That's... Why would somebody leave that in here? Shut up, man. Piss me off. He's gonna turn around it's gonna have moved to some shit. Now, although the doll itself is pretty creepy, it's what it does before that's the most unsettling. Mysteriously, the doll drops on its own as soon as Chris enters the facility. According to viewers, it seemingly moved on its own as though it was taken over by a ghost or an entity of some kind. Like most videos, proving that isn't easy. However, what <laughs> happens later in the video... He never says that, by the way. I've never, ever heard him say, like most videos, proving that isn't easy. He always gives them the benefit of the doubt. It's the one time he's acknowledged it could be fake because it so glaringly is fake that, like, no one can, like... Shut oh, my God. Before Chris leaves the school, suggests that the place may actually be haunted. Chris is looking... What? What? <laughs> right before leaving, he's like, 
this might be haunted. He's seen like a figure. He's seen so much shit. And he's like, it might be haunted. Shut up. Like, obviously it's all fake. But like, you got to bear in mind through his own narrative. He's saying it might. Oh, my God. Looking for an exit when this is captured. Oh, here it is. Another thing. Yeah, they're all like, you know what? Don't get me wrong. It's like, it's like, it's like Mr. Beast content, like ghost hunting, if that makes sense. Because like, obviously, if you really went ghost hunting, you'd never fucking see anything. Like, you'd see like something once in like every like ten videos, and like this guy like creates entertaining content. I'm not. I really want to stress that like I have no issue, fake shit. It's it. You know what? I've I, I've enjoyed watching this clip more than I've enjoyed watching any of the other clips, but. I'm showing you a little bit, for, cause, cause, come on. Hello. <laughs> the hello. He's armed. He's clearly armed right now. Hello. What? Well, you know, if this was like Marble Hornets, it's well done. But like, it, 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 it I think it's the fact that it's claiming to be real that's kind of like, okay, is the reason I keep like coming. He's out. He's dead. There is definitely something weird going on in this school. <laughs> the sound of footsteps going down the staircase is heard above. Yet, when Chris heads over to see if anyone's there, the source is nowhere to be found. Given what happened earlier, this mysterious source makes this place all the more eerie. Without a second of hesitation, Chris hightails out of the school through an exit as it appeared that the alleged paranormal activity was beginning to intensify. Chris <laughs> no doubt believes that the school is haunted, mm -hmm. but the idea of there being a squatter who is mistakenly identified as the ghost or entity inside the building is worth considering according yeah. to viewers. Oddly enough though, we never see the even his viewers were like, it's probably just a dude. <laughs> he, he, I think he, he took it a bit far for this one, I think is the problem. Like, like do a, he took it a bit far. Water or person whenever something odd happens. Whether the school is actually haunted or just riddled by squatters remains a mystery. Right, some balls to go in there. No, you know what? Respect about that, because I'd be creeped out going into that place. Even you know, like even if I was going in to fake a video, I'd be I'd be creeped out by it. I was creeped out when I went and did it at the mansion where we faked shit, because it is supposedly a really actually haunted location, and 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 there was plenty of history and ghost stories from that place. Uh, and I went there like half really ghost hunting, because I was like, if anything actually happens, we've got all the equipment. If anything actually happens. We'll capture it. But I wanted to fake some shit so the video was entertaining. And also, like, I, I actually got some scares out of Scott and Tubbo. But in my video, I was like, as much as we were actually ghost hunting, I pre-planned some shit to scare the guys. But I was also still really looking for ghosts. You know? Like, I... It was a blend. And I made that clear in the video. I think that's the thing. You know? But it only kind of works as a one-off. I do understand that. Uh, either way. Uh... Go check out that video if you want. Jamanifal TV on YouTube. Either way, guys. Have you any idea what time it is? Have you? Oh, hello. Hello. Uh, um, YouTube started listening to me. That was weird. Um, guys, any idea what time it is? Because I'll tell you if you don't know. It's the top of the hour. You know what that means. People, people, people. I need money. And that money doesn't come for free. At the end of the day, you guys can support the stream directly by subscribing, but I realize not everyone is able to afford to do that. And that's completely fine. I would never ask anyone to subscribe if they're not in the position to be comfortably doing that. However, because it 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 because Twitch has an ad incentive program and it really does Twitch like really do help like support me when I play ads. So you guys watching said ads gives me a boost of ad revenue and an extra payout from Twitch. It really does help out a lot. So, because it's top of the hour, I'm going to run a minute-long ad. We'll be back after a singular minute. Please do stick around because we'll be straight back into watching the rest of this video um, when we're back. 
I'm just going to chat to the subs in the meantime. If you really hate ads, though, and you're a fan of these streams and you don't want to watch any ads for the next 30 days, you can always subscribe for the low, low price of 4 99 or for free with the Twitch Prime by clinkly, clinkly, simply clicking subscribe right now and uh, seeing if you have the Prime option available, uh, as you possibly will. Either way, I'm going to run the ad right now. We'll be back in one minute's time. Please do stick around. Go grab some food. Go grab a drink. Uh, I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to take some time to go grab a drink uh, because at the end of the day, it, it really it really does support me. Like, seriously, you sticking around through these ads. I know it's a bit boring, but out of an hour, out of every 60 minutes, one being advertisements where you can just open TikTok and scroll for a minute. I, it, 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 I think, I hope you see that as worthwhile to support me. Anyway, I'm going to run the ad now. I'll see you all afterwards. Take care. Alrighty, the ad is running. Well, subs, uh, I would love to stay in chat, but I'm just going to first go grab some water because I'm very thirsty. Uh, but then I'll get back and we'll talk. Uh, in the meantime, uh, these people are subs and I appreciate them. Saturday's no longer for the boys. They're for manifold streams. Happy 23 months, you well bone structured man. Hey Jack, hope you're having a nice day. Wow! That took the whole ad break. Holy shit, my apologies. Grabbing water takes longer than you think. Well, welcome back from the ads, everybody. You missed nothing because I was spent the whole time getting some water. Ah. They didn't play. Trust me, they did for some people. Whoa, have a fun stream, Jack. Ah! Sorry, you scared me so much. Um, there was no ads. Well, Twitch seems to think I ran one. So if, you, if none of you got ads, look. Twitch seems to think I ran one. So, hey, best of both world, worlds for everyone. I get paid. You didn't even have to watch nothing. All right? You see, some people got one. You know, it works. It doesn't always work for everyone. But at the end of the day, look, look, Twitch, Twitch pays me. That's all that matters. Either way, appreciate all the uh, subs and primes that came through during that and uh, throughout the stream. Sorry, I haven't been too up to date with them. Uh, if I listen to two things at once, my brain melts and leaks out my ears. Um, thank you so much to everyone who's been subbing and priming. Second month like, and loving team. it. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate that. Glad you're loving it. Either way, we've done our ad watching. We've done our ad watching. And that will be the last ad for the rest of the stream because... Um, well, I'll explain. I'll explain later. But there won't be any more ads for the rest of this stream. At least, not like that. Anyway. Let's carry on watching these videos. Thank you to all the subs, seriously. I appreciate it. Frost Punky. Uh, everyone who subbed. Means a lot. Also, we're nearly at 69 subs, which is funny, because that means sex. I don't know if you knew that. Either way. Is that the music off? It's not really on theme, is it? And that's uh Get straight back into it. Macus, thank you for the... Video one. comes from a Ooh, small loud. channel whose only video is the one you're seeing. It was posted on August 20th of 2011. Oh, the wow. Video is much older as it was shot on July 30th of 1994. Ooh, I'm footage. excited about this one. It appears that a group of I love old VHS like creepy footage. That's like my shit. Boring an abandoned house that is Even if it's fake, if it's well done, haunted. I'm going to be hyped. They seem to be doing their own paranormal investigation. Their intention is to communicate with the spirit that lives there, as according to them, this alleged spirit has been visiting one of their friends in their dreams. It's happened more than a few times, which has convinced the friend who's been having these dreams that the spirit is trying to reach them. And so, for this reason, the group decides to visit the house where they think the spirit lives. The house is known for being haunted and is located near them, so they have some reason to think that it lives there. Yet, while oh, being- We got a little bit of lag there, hold on. Can you move the YouTube captions? I just did. I also had that idea. But yeah, all right, we're just- uh, Okay, the lag's over. I just had a little lag spike there. I need to get Ethernet. The, the, the Wi-Fi in this house is insane. Because um, luckily, there's a very lovely Brighton company called Metronet that provided me with my internet. Um, and they're, they're really cool. They've done it for a couple other creators. Um, they're like, they're really cool. And uh, they specialize in Wi-Fi stuff. And they were like, don't worry. 
our Wi-Fi will be good enough. And you know what? For the most part, they're true. Just every once in a while, you get a little bit of interference in the stream lags. So I think I'm going to upgrade. But you know what? Bro did not lie. He was really cool. Move chat. No. I like them. Certain of the spirit's location. Okay. They had no clue as to what would happen while being at this place. If only they knew that coming here was a big mistake. Doing what there? The video starts off with one of the friends knocking on the door. As expected, no one answers. Yeah. A minute passes and the group breaks into the house. This is what they captured. Okay. What language is this, by the way? I saw someone earlier say Romanian in chat, but I'm curious now, like... Months with the manifold man. Oi! The green never stopped. 16 stop. months. I just said months, not even like the number. That's cool. Uh, it's Italian. It sounded Italian to me, but someone said Romanian earlier. And I was like... That's... Definitely sounded very Italian. Italian is such an emotive language. I love it. I love that. It, it's so, like, emotive. The most Italian collection of names, by the way. Happening inside, the group's dialogue definitely helps with understanding the situation. Emotions are running high, and everyone's tense. Clearly. But then, after a couple of seconds, they finally attempt to communicate with the spirit. It is at this point, though, where things get pretty spooky. The group is at the bottom of a staircase, looking up at a room whose door is closed. Oh, okay. I really Supposed can't spirit make out what the video is. to be inside this room as they heard noises coming from inside. Oh, okay. However, the room was empty when they first checked it. They begin to ask questions to the spirit hiding inside when this is captured. <laughs> Fucking no, bro. Ghost, d dude is just like the ghost is gay. He doesn't even ask the ghost if, he, if he's gay. Rodus is like, you're gay. Okay, so it's a man. All of a sudden, a knocking noise is heard. Mind you that nobody was inside when they checked the room. The spirit seems to be knocking as a way of responding to the questions asked by the group. Mm -hmm. They continue to ask questions when suddenly things get really intense. Watch. I will. Why are they all saying iridescent? Well, anyone who knows a little bit more about ghosts than me, is, is there any rhyme or reason to that? Uh, from what I understand, I can barely make out what's going on either. Apparently, the door opened, but I really can't make it out.
No one knows. Okay, interesting. <laughs> What? what are you talking about? <laughs> Bro, he is the group leader 100%. You know how everyone's like, group leader? He is trying to get them under control. Everyone else is terrified. And he's like, shut the fuck up, calm down. That is group leader right there. Those guys have to ask that guy to piss. You know what I mean? They have to ask that guy to get out of bed in the morning and shit. He is the group leader through and through. Out of nowhere, an object falls from inside the room. Following that, the door opens and closes back and forth, seeming as though the spirit It's definitely weird, was upset. but you know. Eventually, something that see on camera Thank makes you. the group run out of the house in complete terror. The video then ends with all the friends running out of the place. Not much info is given on the vid, so it's hard to say if it's It's creepy, but like it's so difficult to make out or understand. It's real or not because they're all shouting over each other and and, and like no. I, i'm confused but when listening to the group's dialogue all responses seem to be genuine it does seem pretty like cool like easily faked you know just plant someone in the room you know check in the room have someone like behind the camera at all times enter the room and then do all that like it's it's not you know but at the same time it's quite creepy if it's real the same could be said for everyone's reactions. But as always... But they did seem for real. Like, like it did seem quite real. They all seemed very scared. And he s seemed, like, to be very genuinely reassuring. I can't pick up on tone very well in Italian. But, like, the words. You know, I was like, oh, touch the cross and stuff. Like, he really, like, you know. What's your stance on this? Ghost or not? You be the judge. Why would they fake it? There wasn't really YouTube content back then. For fun, man. Why do people make movies and shit, you know? I'm not saying, like, they, they, uh, maybe they weren't trying to convince anyone, but maybe they were Hi, trying Jack. to make a cool ghost haven't scene. managed to catch a stream in ages, but finally caught this one on my birthday. Oh, I sick. have now aged three times since I started watching you and to many more ages ahead. Thank you for entertaining me and always making me laugh Thank less than Thank you so much. Three. I appreciate that. That's really cool. The fact that you've aged three times since you started watching is really cool because I've aged three times, which means... Yeah, no, I've aged three times, which means you've been watching since the start, which is really cool. You missed the funny number? No, I didn't. I screamed sex really loud. Did you not hear? In the following Happy video, birthday, a terminally ill grandmother is seen on camera behaving a bit strange. The grandmother in this video goes... Have you just said that... Pause a second. Don't put, is she acting sus? She's nearly dead. Come on. Have a bit of respect. Put in fucking, she's acting sus. That is what I'm about to say. I'm more like saying that like, why are we surprised that an old near death person is acting peculiarly? Like, I don't know if you've ever been around an old person. They have their quirks. Their brain is, I mean, Joe Biden. Just watch any clip of Joe Biden. And he isn't even on death's door, right? Like, old people generally don't have all their marbles. Like, no offense. They just don't always have their marbles together, right? Like, shorter. You know, like, I'm sorry. Not everything's always there with those people. I don't think that this really old dying woman isn't acting quite right is necessarily, like, breaking news. Just my opinion, but we'll watch. Tange, and according to her... A little girl dressed in pink is standing by her bedside. It's worth noting that Tante has never said anything like this before, which makes this video all the more strange. Take a look. 
I'm sorry, I'm not too. What what is amazing, Mom? Can you see this little pink girl here? She's a pink girl. A pink that is incredible. Girl. She's pink. Or is she wearing pink? You can't. No, I can't see the pink girl. Crisscross Grand Oriental. Old person acts out of character. What? Yeah, exactly. Old person acts aloof. And like. <laughs> Ryan, thank you for the sub, man. That was me, sorry. Also, like, it's a near death thing to hallucinate. Absolutely, yeah, that happens all the time, especially to see spirits, because you're probably like, you know, your thoughts are probably on the afterlife in that current moment. Right? You know? But, like,. What the fuck is the question? Is she Chinese? What? <laughs> Bro was like, hmm, I'm pretty sure ghosts are Chinese. If it's, if she's Chinese, we maybe, yeah, then we think. If she's not Chinese, ghosts are Chinese. Like, what is this? I don't quite understand his logic. Maybe he's going to go on to it, but I'm like, I don't think that that's a thing. Bro, like, I'm saying, what? Like, if someone, if, if I thought someone was seeing a ghost, my first question would be, and what is the race of this ghost? What a She's strange... A is she Chinese or Oriental? You. Pardon me? Chinese? Or... Chinese? Thank you for the, uh, prime. Sorry, I'm just a bit perplexed by... Party toiler. Parter. What? They're having a party? What kind of, is it a birthday party with kids? Who, who's having the birthday party? Oh, I, yeah, I don't know. Now there's a certain phenomenon that often happens when a person is close to dying. Many of those who've had a near-death experience reported seeing deceased relatives or people that others can't see. Although it may seem like a frightening experience, near-death patients have claimed otherwise. According to them, the experience wasn't frightening, but rather comforting. It says Yeah, that I'm I'm not the only reason that struck a bit of a chord with me, and this is a me. I wanna thing, go to the party. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> no, because you can't say shit like that. Because my immediate response was, I, I think you have to die, uh, and it, that felt a bit harsh. But also, like, them's the rules, man. I don't, I don't write them. You know, I'm not. Don't do that, please. Please don't do that. Maybe just wait until it's your turn. You know, everyone goes to the party one day, but, um, yeah, maybe, you know, I don't write the rules, but, uh, yeah, either way, um, no, one thing I was gonna, the reason that struck a chord with me, specifically, is I know of a story of, of someone who I, who I truly do trust, so, uh, they, 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 I don't think they're making this up, but at the same time, it is pretty hard to believe that, they were with someone when they were dying. And this person in question has been known to see people, a, me, a median of sorts. They've been known to see people from the other side. They've claimed it a bunch of times. You know, their, 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 their sort of familiarity with spirits and stuff is pretty large. And when this person was dying, they turned to one of the grieving family members. Well, it was their family as well, but, you know, one of their family members who was grieving and to try and comfort them. They kind of entrusted in them that, uh, like, they entrusted them for a moment and told them something and they're like, look, don't mention this, but everyone's here right now to collect her and it's like, and he was, like, watching out the window. He's like, I can see them all outside and... It's like they're holding like a big celebration, like a party. He's like, it's like a ritual. He's like, I don't get it. I'm not a fucking spirit from death side, but like, like they're doing. There's like a there's a there's a niceness to it. It's like they're welcoming her. I don't know how to explain it. 
and that's what he said and it's just i don't know there is a strange sort of it's very com it's a very comforting sort of like a welcome party it's a very comforting thought but um um it i, I don't know it it strikes something with me that that old woman described them as having a party because it aligns with what they saw at someone else's death and the reason i find it intriguing is because obviously she it is known that that dying people do hallucinate however this person i know wasn't the one dying they were just in the presence of someone who was um and they saw a similar thing to what that woman hallucinated um i don't know I don't know. Just a thought. Like, it, it's not unbelievable that that, like, like, realistically, the woman probably hallucinated, but I don't know. You know? Definitely a, um, definitely a, a point worth considering, I guess. Anyway. Let's go and watch the video. I just, I just wanted to, uh, wanted to tell that story because I think, I think that makes it all the... Oh, the deceased the relative they saw was reassuring them that even after death, they'd be okay. Given that during the time of this video, Tante was entering hospice, which is a form of health care given to those who are terminally ill, viewers believe that she was experiencing this exact phenomenon. Whether Tante had seen a ghost or not, it's nice to know that whatever she had seen was at least comforting in some way during her final days. <laughs> Someone said, I have paranormal experiences all the time, and then said, unfortunately, I have schizophrenia, which... Yeah, like uh, admittedly, that might explain it. I, I I think you've you've I think you've found your solution. So that'll probably be it. I, I, sorry to hear that though. I, I schizophrenia is one of my biggest fears. It it genuinely is. Like it's it's it sounds like such a. No, 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 I, I, there's plenty of people who live and deal with it very very well, but it uh, it's one of those things that just like scares the fuck out of me, man. Because, like, um, I, I, what I learned is that it's it, it doesn't tend to develop in people until between the age of 25 to 30. And, like, which means that I could live... I, I, I'm, I'm 20, right? Like, I'm living life right now. I'm just adjusting to, like, adult life. And then in four years' time, I could just start seeing and hearing shit. And that can just happen. And... There is nothing I well obviously there's treatments once you get it but like there's nothing I can do like it's not like I can like oh if you if you eat well you're you're less like, like there's nothing you can fucking do like it's it, that that's a scary thought man that shit scares me unless your relatives have it there's a very small chance you get it yeah but I do have all these um these these relatives that uh supposedly have the sixth sense you know so um you know it, it could be argued that um. Instead of it being a family heritage of sixth sense, it's instead a family heritage of, of uh, hallucinations. So, you know, really, like, it really, it's up in the air. You know, that's one of the things I think about sometimes. Um, it is a little bit up in the air. But you never know. As she had recently passed away. If you caught something creepy on camera, or if there's any ghost videos you'd like me to check out and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at I know, I did that. I did that. Oh, that being said, screen. let's get back to the video. All right, the last one. Then we'll rank which ones I've last thought video, were the most convincing. A group of friends are hanging out inside a basement when something pretty creepy is caught on camera. Okay. At the start of the vid, the friends are having a conversation when one of them heads over to a room where the lights are off. Okay. What's seen inside has left the dark is scary. <laughs> the Take dark. <laughs> it's very scary, guys. I'm scared of the dark. <laughs> Are you serious? Dude, it's dark. Oh. Okay, fine. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on. Dude, I'm not standing alone. Turn, <laughs> Turn the lights on. I'm not standing alone. I'm gonna do mouse. this. I'll do it. I can't see anything. There's no mouse in here. There's something in there. I There's not. Did you get it? I can't see it. Oh, what? Fuck! Why is, is my awesome. camera broke? Fuck, man. I keep accidentally leaving it on overnight is the problem. I, 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 I've done this like twice now. I've accidentally left it on like overnight. And I think it overheats. 
Hopefully it isn't permanently broken. But it felt cool to the touch. It's as if it turned itself off. Fuck! I pulled the face as well. That was a creepy... That, that shit creeped me out. That shit, like, actually jump scared me a little bit. Oh, God, I said, hello? Fuck! Oh, that, that's... Fuck, man. I'm pissed. I'm sorry. I think I'll grab my other camera, worst case. The, the battery for this one might even be, have a little bit of charge in it. If it does, we can we can use that. I don't know where the, I don't. I must admit, I don't know where it is. Though. Anyway, let's carry on. Um, Friends are having a conversation when one of them heads over to a room where the lights are off. Let's watch that again. Sorry. What's seen inside? It's back here. Yeah, no, beyond spot, spooked. Thank you. Take a look. Dude, that's creepy, man. That shit actually caught me off guard. That's like, uh, that, that, that's like a face that's like moving almost. That shit's creepy, man. That shit actually freaked me out. That's the one that's spooked. <laughs> Beyond spooked? Yeah, they were spooked. That's the creepiest one we've seen so far. Did you get the mouse trail? Yeah. If you look closely, there appears to be a face inside the room. Yes, no. Weirdly enough, though, it's Almost no longer there when the lights are turned fright. on. Crazy how time flies. The friends flies. claim oh, they have caught you, a man. strange figure Appreciate inside. It. But to this day, nothing else is known about this video. Real or not, the appearance of this thing is just pretty unsettling. It's very face-like. Like, I, I'd I usually argue it's like just like a weird, like, lighting issue or something strange. But that's like, that, that shit is a fucking face. As bro. always, feel free to let me know what you think. That one's creepy. That's for real creepy. Thanks for watching. Uh, that's the one. Either way, feel free to subscribe to uh, uh, Bizarre Bub because it's a cool channel. Uh, but anyway, let's rank these. Uh, number one was the German couple. That was that had some creepiness to it, but I don't know. Like uh, I'm, I'm a skepticism about it. Uh, it wasn't like anything. I'm like, oh, that is just like unprovably like. Like, that's, like, uh, the ones that really creep me out are the ones that just feel unprovable. Like, I look at them, I'm like, there is no way of explaining what happened here, and, and it's unnerving. And, like, I don't know, I feel like this could be pretty easily, like, faked and explained. But kind of creepy. Four is most, is, is, four's up there for, and I think it's actually my most favorite clip we've ever watched. But because it was so funny, this shit was hilarious. Uh, the, hello, I'm gonna take out my gun. I wanna watch that one more time. Him kicking down the door, fucking saying hello. I need one more. I need, I need that in my life one more time. Hello. <laughs> fucking FBI. <laughs> you know what I mean? It was like, FBI, open up! You know, imagine they just went, Hello? Shit's great. That, that, that's like a top 10. That's like a top 10 things that are funny for me. That, that, that shit really got me. Uh, but yeah, that one was good. Uh, the Italy one is creepy, but it's way too fucking hard to see. Um, the grandma... I think in terms of like... C I'm convinced that there was paranormal activity in this video. Number four is at the bottom. That shit is so obviously faked. It's fucking unreal. Uh, like, good video, but, but obviously fake. Uh, the next one is the old lady it doesn't particularly convince me in ghosts. It just appears that she like is hallucinating because she's near death, which is sad. Like, but and even if it was proving that ghosts are real, it's more comforting than scary. So also like you know, then it's the German couple. I uh, know I'm not massively convinced by anything in that video. Um, then the Italy one is more weird, but really hard to see. So it's really hard for me to gauge it. And then number one is like that. That's the fucking weirdest. That face is like actually fucking creepy and hard to explain. <laughs> like that's, it's very face like. A group of friends conversation has left them be. Take. <laughs> Are you serious, dude? dude it's done. That's a face, man. Like that, that looks like a fucking face. Oh, also the Italians going, he's gay to the ghost, and the dude being like, why would you say that? Is also like a, a, a is a pretty good moment. Don't know if you've told us before. But from a scale of 1 to 10, how much of a believer are you? It's funny. So, um, I, I would, years ago, it'd be like bottom end of the scale, like 2, 3, you know, like real low. But nowadays, it's, 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 I don't know. 
my general understanding Ten of the world and the universe and spirituality and everything like that, because I have I have pretty like concrete beliefs, uh, don't really allow for ghosts. However, and my understanding of the way the world works doesn't allow for ghosts. And like, and uh, so it's, it, but at the same time, I, there's many people I love and trust that have had experiences. We had that experience on stream. Some of these videos are kind of like weird and very difficult to fake. Um, but like, you know, we had that experience on stream. That, I went to bed that li- night, like, scared. Like, I went to sleep, like, like, on edge. Because I was like, fuck. I experienced a presence that I could not identify. It wasn't in my head. Like, in the past, I've been like, maybe it was just in my head. I, I do occasionally think I've heard things that I haven't, right? I've had, like, little ghost experiences before, but I could have heard things. Like, you know, I, I've either been, like, half asleep or something like that. But I, that shit was captured on stream. Other people heard that. That's weird. That's weird, right? That's undeniably... I know in my heart of hearts that wasn't fake. Like, I know I've never once heard the neighbors in that apartment. It's way too high up to hear anything from the streets. Eleanor was way too far away and, like, working with her AirPods in. Maybe, 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 low, low, 99, 99.9% sure this wasn't the case. But technically, she could have been trolling, but, like, absolutely almost certain that that wasn't the case. Because she seemed just as creeped out as me. And there is no... I never heard the neighbors, ever. They, those walls are thick in that apartment. You know, she's throwing parties and no one's ever complained. Like, like the walls are thick in that apartment. Like, I, I, never once. So I'm, I'm so, so, like, adamant that that was a ghost. Yet my worldview doesn't allow it. So I'm like, I don't know how to feel. So I don't know how to, like, numerically say, like, maybe a seven. Like, at this point, I'm actually more convinced than not. And I would definitely argue for the longest time I wasn't. But, I, man, I got people that I love and fully, fully trust and no wouldn't lie to me that have experienced some shit, man. So, I don't know. It's definitely like I'm up there now. I think a lot of these videos are fake, though. Um, for the simple reason that everyone I know who's had a ghost experience has a- never seen anything they could capture physically on a camera. You know? That's the thing. Like, like shapes and spirits. I've never once... Sounds I'm convinced by because it fucking happened to me, but like I, I don't know. I, I'm not so convinced by a lot of the videos. I think a lot there's a lot of gain to faking it. Um, but like everyone I know, if they can see spirits, they can see them, but they couldn't fucking film them. Uh, and if and if they've had an experience, it's a voice they've heard or like, and other people, you know, I just, you know, I don't know. I'm just saying. I think, there's, I think there's a lot of people faking it out there. But there, I think there are some people that have captured real shit. Again, I know. Could have been Eleanor walking by the room you were streaming. Yeah, but why would she go, I need your help? And she wasn't. She was sat down in her chair on her laptop, like, listening to something with AirPods in. So it wasn't something she was playing out loud because her sound was going through her AirPods. Um, she'd been at the desk, right? Like, like I, and why would she go, Jack, I need your help? Unless she needed my help, you know? Like, that's what, that's what I'm saying. It's just weird. It's just, it's just all a bit like, maybe she was on the phone to someone, but she wasn't. I, I asked her, you know? It doesn't even really sound like her either. Like, it doesn't sound enough like her. And again, I'll play the clip again. It doesn't sound enough like her in my opinion. Um, let me find it. Let me find it. Uh, I don't even think it sounds. I don't think it sounds enough like her even. Edge when you hear noises. You know what I mean. If anything, what freaks me out a bit is it sounds similar to my accent, or like not mine, but like the Mansfield. You know the Mansfield accent. The sort of like you I, know need, what I mean. I need your help. I need your help. It's very like sounds robotic. Yeah. A little bit, but like, you know, it it sounds a little bit, you know, you know, you know what I mean? It's just weird. Where's your scalp? What? It's just weird.